In this session, our aim is to discuss how to form basic blocks using leader statements. So, let us suppose there is a high level language written program. We shall have to write the respective three address code. And in this three address code, we shall have to select the leader, what are, what are the leaders are there. So, leader statements are to be detected and then my three address code will be divided into certain basic blocks and block wise we shall be doing our optimization. So, this is our main aim here. Let us discuss how to uh, get the leader statements and how to form the basic blocks. So, input algorithm partition into basic blocks. So, that is our purpose. Input a sequence of three address statements initially high level language program will be given to us or given to the compiler and then compiler will make the three address code against the respective high level language statements. Output a list of basic blocks with each three address statement in exactly one block. So, that full three address statement list will be divided into uh, one or more than one or multiple basic blocks. What are the methods? Method point number one and point number two we first determine the set of leader statements. What, what is the leader statement? The first statement of the three address code will be a leader statement. So, the first statement of the three address code, whatever the code you have given, say we are having 20 such uh, codes are there. So, out of these 20 such statements, the first statement will be known as a leader statement or leader. Any statement which is a target statement of conditional or unconditional statements is a leader. So, from unconditional and conditional statements, we can also elaborately we can mention that conditional or unconditional go to that will be if it is clear to you also you can write. So, conditional or unconditional go to statements which is the target statement will be a leader. Okay? Any statement which is immediately follows a conditional go to is a leader. So, any statement which is just after the conditional go to, conditional go to means if flag is equal to 0, then go to line number 3. If flag is equal to 0, then go to line number 3. So, the next line just after this if statement will be another leader. Here it is conditional go to because unconditional go to if we are having say go to step uh, statement 3, then obviously the next statement will be unreachable. So, how can you make that one leader? So, that is why they have mentioned that condi conditional go to the statement which is after this conditional go to will be another leader and the statement which is a target of this conditional or unconditional go to will be a leader. So, that has been mentioned in step 2 and it is the step 3. Now, from one leader statement to the to the just prior statement of the next leader. So, this is one leader, this is another leader statement. So, from this leader, the statement just before this next leader will be one basic block. Okay? Now, let us suppose this is a leader statement and there is no leader statement afterwards, there is no leader statement. Then from this particular leader statement to the last statement will be another basic block. So, from this particular from this particular leader statement to the statement prior to this leader will be a basic block and from this particular statement to the last statement if there is no other leader statement there will be another basic block. So, it has been mentioned that from one leader statement to the a just prior statement of the next leader, if no such leader statement is present, then up to the last statement will form a basic block. And if you find that there is some statements are still there which have got not included to any one of the basic blocks can be removed, can be discarded from the program silently. So, this is the case. So, in this way, the basic blocks can be formed. I think it will be better if you can explain this one with a proper example. So, in our next video, we shall go for the example where I shall be giving you uh, say uh, one uh, sample high level language program, then we will be writing the respective three address code, then we shall find the which, which are the leaders, then we shall go for the basic block formation and that will be a good, uh, good, good understanding on this particular topic. So, be with us, thanks for watching this video.